Do you remember Friendster? Ever wondered what happened to it? Well, buckle up as we're about to take a trip down memory lane and unravel the story of Friendster, the social networking site that once was. In the early days of social media, before the advent of Facebook and Twitter, Friendster was the talk of the town. Founded by Canadian computer programmer Jonathan Abrams in 2002, it was one of the first platforms that connected people online in a way that mimicked real-life relationships. Friendster was revolutionary. It introduced the concept of friends of friends, where users could connect with friends of their friends, expanding their network. This was a novel concept at the time, and it quickly gained popularity, reaching over 3 million users in just three months. However, as is often the case in the tech world, rapid growth also brought challenges. Friendster struggled with technical issues due to its sudden user influx, causing slow loading times and frequent site crashes. These technical issues, coupled with a lack of a clear business strategy, began to tarnish Friendster's reputation. In 2003, Google offered to buy Friendster for a whopping $30 million, but the offer was declined. Abrams and his team believed in the potential of Friendster and wanted to grow it independently. Looking back, this decision might have been a turning point in Friendster's journey. In the following years, Friendster's popularity waned. New social networking sites such as MySpace and Facebook entered the scene, offering smoother user experiences and innovative features. By 2006, Friendster had lost its top spot in the social networking world. In an attempt to revive its fortunes, Friendster underwent a significant overhaul in 2009, rebranding itself as a social gaming platform. However, it was too little too late. The user base continued to shrink and eventually in 2015, Friendster officially shut down. So, what happened to Friendster? It was a combination of factors. Technical difficulties, strategic missteps, stiff competition, and perhaps a bit of bad luck. But despite its downfall, Friendster left an indelible mark on the world of social networking, pioneering features and concepts that are now commonplace. To summarize, Friendster was a trailblazer in the world of social networking. Founded in 2002, it quickly rose to popularity, but faced technical and strategic challenges. Despite attempts to reinvent itself, Friendster couldn't keep up with the competition and eventually shut down in 2015. Its story serves as a reminder of the rapid and unpredictable nature of the tech world, but it also underscores the impact and influence early innovators can have, even if they don't stay on top forever.